just wanna have fun, clap my hands, turn around now and dance, dance, dance. I just wanna have fun, clap my hands, turn around now and dance, dance, dance. I also had a salmon thing, <laughs> but I already ate that because I couldn't eat. I was way hungry. It's uh, the weirdest Costa I've ever been in. Like it's Costa, but it's not. Hello. But oh well. Uh, we've got latte macchiato, something I've never had before. I don't think Anna's had that before either. She's obviously going to love that. Is it nice? <laughs> Broken heart. Where are we? Big tower. <laughs> Ailey, where are we? Tower. Big tower. tower. Well, we're at Alexander Platz. That is massive. We're uh, doing a bit of sightseeing or tourism -y thingies uh, for the morning. Uh, and then we're going to head to the venue shortly. Uh, well, we'll be there for about the first event only start. No, second event, which is the one we want to watch, starts uh, at 25 past one. So that's round about where we're going to head head there because we don't really want to see not not want to, but there's no way Haley's going to sit down for the entirety of Linda. So we're going to go explore a little bit, see Berlin, see all the cool World War II sites, and then uh, head to the venue. Look at the pretty station. So clean as well. And literally like three people. <laughs> oh, you're making me dizzy. And this one. You're making me dizzy. You're making me dizzy. Oh, I'm dizzy. <laughs> Pretty cool, isn't it? Yeah, it's pretty well done. Yeah. Brandenburg, Brandenburg Gate isn't super exciting. Like, it's really cool. It's very cool. But, but it's, it's not the most exciting. Such a tourist. Yeah. I mean, all of these are. This is just quite large. It's literally like a city block size. So there's a lot of space for the amount of people. With the Brandenburg Tour, there's like pubs and stuff around there. And it's like one of the, probably the most famous site in Berlin where you can get pictures of the horses and stuff on that. Up top, um, I think we're going to go through the park to the Reichstag building next, which is that way. Um, we'll go through the park and then we need to look for a bit of a supermarket-ish thing yeah, for Haley. Yeah, yeah. so uh, and then we'll, we'll loads of, still loads of time. Cool, we'll uh, see you at the Brandenburg Gate. What's your favorite food? Is it rice? Yeah, rice. Yeah, rice. <laughs> yeah, this is delicious, isn't it? Join these barbells, and before they can do that, they've got to go through those 800 meters. When you see a judge's hand in the air, What's that? Oh yeah! Oh wow! Oh, yeah. 
Oh. What's Annie Thor's butter done in about to snatch? No, no. No, no. no. <laughs> Sorry. Crayola, looking for 190 on platform 7. Big Al, a good for 175. Matt is going to be going for 180 right now. For 200, also Big Al, watch out. day two that was freaking epic watching the the men lift i only saw a couple of last lifts just because of Haley. it was so cool feeling the the crowd go absolutely nuts is really really cool i really enjoyed that so at the end of day one we've currently got for the men because that's the the only well we did see the woman but i'll get to that in a sec we've got lazar dukic Anyway, with a third event uh, finish, third, that's kind of convenient. Is that an hour? No, it's 13 minutes, 17 seconds, and 76 split seconds, I guess. Uh, then fourth on the snatch with a 280 pound snatch, and 12th on the event five, which was the snatch and then the run, which is pretty good. Yonikowski, who was like I said, one of my favorite athletes, got a 18th, 11th, and 15th with a 275 snatch. And then BKG, who I think a lot of people are rooting for, uh, did second, got second in the snatch with a 285 pound snatch and 314, so 50, 11th, sorry, in the workout five. And then Ulda Supernix rounds out 11th with BKG at 8th, Yonikoski at 6th, and Lazar Dukic at 1. First place. Very happy with that. I'm very excited about David Sharunki. Sharunki, I'm not sure how I say that. Um, from the UK at number 5, which is cool. It's going to be his first time, as far as I'm aware, going to the games, which I'm really excited about. Anyway, then we've got the girls, or the women, as they say on the CrossFit site. Uh, we actually got to watch the final two events from... Yes, do you want to come sit with me? I'm here. Uh, from the, for the women, it's really, really cool to watch. Uh, Gabby Magal is currently at first. She got a 200 pound snatch. The snatches were so cool to watch. To be honest, I feel like the men, this might be because of my positioning. So when we, when we watched the men, I was stood at the bottom, right, right next to the crowd. It was really, really cool. And when we were watching the woman, we sat right at the top. It's just easier for Haley. Uh, we literally strapped the screen to the wall and it was easy to watch. Uh, anyway, Gabby Magala got third with a 200 pound snatch. Then Annie Thoris' daughter got fifth, which is really good. She missed her first snatch actually with a 195 pound snatch. She got eighth in the second, so very consistent. Seventh, eighth, second, fifth, eighth. Uh, Gabby Magala got third, then a 14th, uh, which cost her a little bit, but she's still first overall. Third and a second, first, third and a second. 
then we have Emma Toll, who's as consistent, 10th, 1st, 7th, 16th, 11th. Uh, she's at 4th. And the Laura Horvath is, she had a 23rd, which was the running event. She's not crazy good at running. She's very good at the other cardio stuff, but the running punishes her a little bit. And you'll see that very soon as well. Then 4th, 4th, 2nd, and then an 18th on the far on the on number five which again is a running event running is not her strong suit there emma mcquaid from ireland is at eighth jennifer muir from the uk ninth currently looking very good and then eliza fuliano eliza fuliano however i say that is at 11th sarah sigmund's daughter who a lot of people are rooting for you can hear when she goes on uh she's at 12th currently with a couple of really bad finishes 26th in workout number two 18th workout number four it's not the end of the world like she's consistently in the lowest number of the of the group i guess which is which is not bad so yeah she should make it but we'll see all right that's gonna be the end of this vlog Haley's losing her temper so we'll see you next we'll see you tomorrow